Hello. How's it going? How you doing? It's a little cold in here. It's, it's starting been, to snow. It's starting to snow in yeah. Michigan. Zach's got something special he wants to tell you. We've started um, recording the demos for our new songs. We will have um, a new song by the beginning of 2019. That's January 2019. New material. And then we will be releasing a song a month. And if we don't, I will try my best to eat a sock, but I probably won't get around to it as a personal challenge, you know, an incentive to keep with the schedule, but we'll see how that goes. We will be presenting the debut of the monologue of our recording of the fourth studio album from Wide Track Incorporated. As though we were a You already going corporate, huh? No, 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 no. From Wide Track, the band who's still roughing it to make it. But the main point is we're going to be documenting the process that we've been going through for a little while of writing and recording and mixing and how all of that works and how do you, has that even, what's that do anyways? And what, what are all those thingies? <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I'm ready now. When I go to warmoth.com, when I select my fretboard wood, I select only exotic woods. Maple? <laughs> Rosewood? Never forget. Blackwood tech? Genetically engineered wood? Come on, get out of here. Nothing substitute real, natural tone. Come on. And while you're at it, why don't yeah. you get some exotic tone wood picks? Hmm? That's right. I didn't think you'd thought of that, and I bet you hadn't either. Yeah. Why is your tone suffering? What are you using, plastic? Are you kidding me? Yeah. You are desecrating your tone. You, I'm not even going to get started on anything else, but you should you should start with tone wood. If you don't even know tone wood, come back when you're ready. Yeah. What'd you stop? Come on, man. Lay down some sear and scorching bass. Wow. The music is a bit more complex than white track music typically is. But I think, you know, all this is really balanced out with um, a general love for melodic lines and catchy riffs and stuff like that, so I don't really know how much it's a musical style rather than just we're experimenting more and more and it's getting outside of our comfort zone a little bit. So. Yeah, it's always kind of a thing of like, how do you want to play when you get on stage, you know? You just want to freaking rock it out, and that will lead you to wonderful places. I mean, that's the, essentially... The you, basis for most of the... It's the basis. It's, it, for it, it's, most of the songs that we've written, we thought, how, how do we want to play this on stage, you know? It's like, do you want to play something with an acoustic guitar on stage? Do you really want to play a basic song with some lyrics over it that you just kind of do this motion with and 
use muscle memory for the rest of it, or do you want to do something that's a little bit challenging and something that's yeah, unfamiliar? Just, yeah, and, that, that, that's, the, that's the what I was just going to say. The lack of uh, been there, done that, the, there's an unfamiliarity that's exciting, you know? It's like discovering a new... Uh, and that excitement dream. will reflect off of people, I think. You know, it's like you see somebody playing drums and it's like you can tell when they're doing something that pushes them and you mm -hmm. know it just gets you pumped or you know with yeah. any instrument really indeed so, yeah so more to come yeah see what we can do how you doing i'm doing grand why is that because we got something special for you. Coming this Sunday, we will be releasing our new song on well, the platforms where we have control, being YouTube, and to all of you directly, to those who may want it. Very excited about this one. Without giving too much away. I'm not saying the title, I'm sorry. It's, no, it's a surprise. It's a high energy song, right? I suppose so, yeah. Yeah. Pretty high energy, so uh, we're hoping that this will be the opening track of our new album when all songs are finally... I guess we would be able to call it an album by then with how many songs we have, but yeah, who yeah. knows. Yep. <laughs> it's a really emotional moment in the studio. Look at all this fancy stuff. And I'm sorry. I didn't know. Look, I didn't know. Time to find it. Okay, let's do it. Are I'm you ready. mad? Are you nice and... Okay. Okay. I, you went to a lot of different places there. All right, right let's do right. it. Halfter! Back in the studio tonight. How you doing? Keep, keep doing it. Keep working. Get back to work. Slacker. Zach the, slacker. A, Zach the Slacker. It's always a psychological mind game to get the best performance out of Zachary. Oh my god, hi! Oh my god, I didn't see you there, Chuck! How are you? And I'm not just saying that. We we promise. What's up, man? It sounds a lot cooler with headphones on, I swear. But... Over there tearing it up. Do some quads, man. Whoa, 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 I'm getting dizzy. Slow down. Oh, we're going in already. Involuntarily going into the vortex. Oh, how you doing? Ron and Zach here. And uh, things are going good. Just wanted to say hey. And uh, let Zach rock out for you a little bit. As he's All well right. equipped. All right, best drum meet has to be in seven, right? So that's that's a prerequisite. But, you know, you think, what's the best? All right, well, first, let's just do something in seven. Basic stuff, right? Easy. All right, 
But now, you have to do the bride and the high at the same time. One, right? Two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, okay, four, yeah, that's in seven. We got it. But now, what else do you have to do? You have to add time in there. All right, throw a nine in there. Who cares? All right, Prague, it's time. All right, but anyways, congratulations. You've done it. You now can drum for, I don't know, probably, probably Dream Theater. Hey, how's it going? How you doing back there? I'm doing good. I'm on the lookout. If I hit anything, you'll know. We uh, just wanted to say hey, and uh, Zach's getting cold, so we're headed back up to the to the crib here. But hey, Zach, well, why don't you thank everybody for the response to our new song? Hey, thank you so much. We just put this one out, and it was an absolute blast to make. It was a really great experience. We're glad you all like it, and we're glad that we could, uh, you're, you're going fast there, buddy. Cool. All right, and we're glad that we could get it out to you and that it's had such a warm reception, and uh, we hope that the next one can fulfill your expectations um, just as whatever else we can. We uh, hope to do the best just for you all. Woo, saved my life. I owe you everything. Yeah, you do. <laughs> we'll see. Doing. I'm doing great. How are you all doing at home? It's been a very long time since we've gotten with you, but in that time we've uh, gotten quite a few things out, one of which is our song Gone Dark, uh, which thank you all for the positive and supportive feedback. It is uh, very well appreciated to know that um, you've all enjoyed and uh, since the release of that. You yeah, know, we, uh, we, we've been kind of like uh, wondering what people would think about you know, a lot of this yeah. new music is a departure from the stuff that uh, we, we've we done previously. Or, I mean, at least I hope it is, because, uh, yeah. you know, you got to move forward when it's progressive, you know? Right. I'm just saying, it's got to progress, right? I mean, yeah. isn't that the point of the name? Anyways, speaking <laughs> of which, moving forward, uh, a lot of the stuff that we're going to be putting out, um, we hope is going to be a little bit of uh, new ground covered in the same sort of... Uh, Bang, you know, same old wide track, but uh, new new paths, new territories explored. Who knows? Mm. Do it again. All right, here we go. Let's hear that. Okay.
damn it, I saw you and I started freaking out. So most of the material for the album has been written, um, a lot of it's been released, you've heard at least half the album. Um, I say at least because I'm not really sure how many we've put out, and I'd give you a direct percentage, but it's just not happening. So a lot of the stuff that we have yet to release to you, uh, we think is some of the best stuff yet, and uh, we really look forward to getting that in your ears. We've been working hard this year on uh, new songs. It was kind of a lot to, lot to bite off with uh, doing one new song a month. Yeah, especially with uh, other real life obligations. Yeah, our uh, cover band, The Vintage, has been really busy, and that that takes up a lot of our of our time. In a perfect world, it would be uh, an easy feat, yeah. but in uh, in wide track land, it's a. Uh, it is uh, no small task, but yeah. I feel like uh, that's a little bit of the uh, charm, and uh, I hope that's uh, at least somewhat reflected in the music. Uh, you know, maybe it works as our excuse for why is this, this song done? You know, guys, it's part of the part of the atmosphere. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, uh, buddy. You know, it's been a it's been a really cool thing. That, you know, you get uh, working on something, and this is the first collaborative effort that White Tracks had on any real sort of uh, composer level and that's it's really taken things to a nice new place and uh, your reactions have been 
very encouraging in that regard. Absolutely. So. Thank you all for the kind words and such. It's uh, inspiring, among many other things. Indeed. You hear that? Zach's recording some new music. It's going to be a good one. Anyhow, we've been working really hard and uh, we're almost done with all of this album and uh, it's going to be wonderful to be finished with it because we're going to be busting our butts to get out there and play for you guys. So stay tuned. Thank you for your patience as far as us um, promising to play. It's just uh, one thing has happened than another. So we're just following where it leads. But uh, as of today, it's leading to a good place. So more to come and uh, rock on. put me on the spot like that it's too much and I just want to say um, you know to the people who've been keeping up our close friends and far friends alike uh, thank you sincerely sorry I was enjoying a little Tim Hortons Pro product placement uh, yeah <laughs> By the time we got finished mixing it, we, we were both done with this song. Like, it was like, okay, that, that was, you know, some of so, songs can be like children. And from what I hear from women when they give birth, some of them come right out and others you're in labor and it's long and painful and exhausting. Fortunately, we're almost to the end and we're, we're gonna need a little break away from this stuff before we go to the final stages of uh, preparing it for its eventual release.
we, uh, we just finished mixing the final song. It's done. There's nothing left to do. We've finished it. It's over. It's... It's done. So, um... Yeah, that was nice. It's kind of like... Yeah, it's... It's great. It's... It's the best album in the world. Um, I haven't heard anything like it ever. It's groundbreaking, revolution. I think we invented a couple new genres on it. No, but in all seriousness, um, you know, it was a, a long trial throughout the year and a, a very strenuous one with trying to put out a song a month. But, um, you know, now you can say uh, we've done it. And uh, that's about that. We're not that. gonna do it again. Yeah, uh, we're gonna. <laughs> it was cool. <laughs> we're cool the, experiment, uh, but we're gonna put the next one song a month thing on hold until yeah. we're both retired or whatever. You yeah. know. Um, as I'm sure you all know, real life is um, the most boring, but um, y you know, prominent hurdle to get over in uh, in every endeavor. So. But, you know. I think it'll be really cool live. We've been kind of practicing stuff a little bit and. Well, it's it's going to be high energy yeah, stuff. Yeah, we'll see live. if we can actually get some uh, rehearsal clips. I think those would be yeah pretty neat. So, uh, yeah. so 2020 is going to be all about playing live. We got enough music f for a while to get out there. So, okay. thank you, thank you, thank you, and thank you. Shucks, man. You know what? Thank you. And thank you. Stop practicing for just a minute. Whoa. Okay. Well, how else am I supposed to play all the crazy lines in the new fourth album of Wide Tracks material if I don't practice every single day and every waking minute? Touche. Touche. It's, it's going to be a happen. good 2020, yeah. I think. Yeah. No, I'm feeling yeah. good about it. I hope you're feeling good about it, too. Yeah. And thank you for all your support throughout this year while we were making our new album. The new album will be released on Zach's 16th birthday, April 23rd. Pre-orders will be on my birthday, March 24th. So, yeah, everything's lining up really good. I'm feeling good about 2020 and the way yeah. that it's, things are panning out. We're just so glad that our sense of humor has enticed you this far. Uh, now we will bid you a proper farewell unto the new year and the new decade to whatever new opportunities await you and us alike. That's right. Keep on rocking.